<laughs> Hello and welcome back everybody to episode number three of the legitimate unboxing. Today we're unboxing another box. This is uh, very exciting and didn't really anticipate on these unboxings to becoming a series, but here it is. So there is this company called Boss Roland and it's essentially one company, but Boss they do different effects for guitars and other knickknacks. And Roland do you know, keyboards, amps, speakers, drums, basically everything almost, I think almost everything music related. And together they're called Boss Roland. And recently I somehow, through the grape vine, got on the phone with those people. And we had really fun conversation. And uh, they sent me a box. And now we're gonna open that box. It's, uh, I, so, I sort of know what's in the box. And probably you know already because you read the, uh, the video title or the description or you saw it in the thumbnail. But this is exciting. This is, uh, this is something, now I gotta figure out where the, where the top is. I think this falls like that. I'm dropping it already. It falls like that. I think I think this is this is gonna be where we're gonna open it. I have scissors, it's really important. And uh, and uh, okay, we, we got this tape. Okay, we're gonna cut it here. This is the most exciting part. This is legitimate unboxing. I have not seen the contents of this box, so um, I, I'll try to describe as best as I can, but you see what happens when you do legitimate unboxing and I've explained that in the prior episodes. You get too excited and then you forget half the things that you were gonna say. So you'll just have to, you'll just have to bear with me. All right, I think, I think scissors are no longer needed. So we rip this thing. Very cool, uh, very, very secure shipping. That's how it's supposed to be. Lots of, uh, lots of air and you can pop it. Oh, this is, this is for later. This is very therapeutic. I'm gonna use this later. We're just gonna take it out and uh, we can uh, take a peek, take a peek into the box. Check this out. It's GT. It, 1000 this is this is a brand new effects and amp it's like does everything you know except for like meal preparation other than that other than that it does everything um, check this out check out this box this is a guitar effects processor and uh, wow this is this is very cool. It opens like that. Wow, this is that's that's how boss things come. You know, they, they always come neatly, neatly packaged. I'm assuming it's gonna be uh it's gonna be uh the, the, the power supply here and some other cables. It's uh Alright. Man, this is tiny. I thought it was gonna be bigger. We got instructions. Um, usually I, I would throw it into the trash, <laughs> this is a brand new thing and I have, have, uh, we're gonna need this, we're gonna use this as, a, as our reference guide. And, uh, we're gonna close this up. Alright, we're gonna rip this open. Holy shit. This is uh, so from what I was told, basically it has, it has everything uh, in regards to guitar processing and guitar effects. And this is a brand new technology, A-I-R-D. So instead of like GT 100 and then, you know, adding another zero, they actually uh, I looked things up and they rebuild it from uh, ground up. Um, check out the back, all kinds of switches in the back. You can, um, 
You have sends and returns and sends again. <laughs> and XLR sub outs. Oh my God, this is, this is great. You know, my first pedal ever when I, when I came to US, it took me a little bit of time to save up to it. It was a Boss RC3, which was a loop station. And then most of the pedals that follow afterwards were also all Boss. And uh, actually my synthesizer is Roland. I had a Roland drum pad. My looper is by Boss, you know, and, and all of those pieces, you know, it took a lot of time, you know, to save up money to actually buy it. And now I have this relationship, uh, the beginning of the relationship with Boss Roland, which is very exciting. I don't know what to call it. I don't know if it's like an artist endorsement or kind of thing. I just call it like a relationship. We haven't hung out yet, you know, they haven't like invited me to dinner or, or you know, at their uh, like getaway weekend villa. There's none of that yet, but it's uh, really exciting. This is just an unboxing video. I'm gonna make an in-depth review of this piece in another video and uh, I'm gonna be using it. And there's gonna be some exciting announcements. I was told there's gonna be something, there's gonna be something really exciting, I think like this week announced, and I will announce it too once they tell me what that is. It's like, it's like very interesting, you know, confidential, there's confidential information, there's some information, sort of like, uh, almost like Marvel Cinematic Universe, but in this case, it's, uh, it's a Boss Roland, Roland Guitar Matic musical universe, you know. Let's open this box just for shits and giggles. Have a pretty good clue of what, what's gonna be in here. We have a uh, this wrapper. Okay, we got power supply one end, and then we have another end of power supply, and this is so here it is. Uh, Boss GT 1000 legitimate unboxing. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to I, I can I can feel you in the comments now. Just, just plug it in man plug it in. I'm gonna plug it in and uh, I'm gonna play through different presets or banks that are already in it and uh, And uh, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna talk. I'm just gonna be you know playing with some sounds But you'll have to wait for another video in a, in a week or so, where I do like an in-depth review of this, uh, of this uh, unit. Now, this is something you normally control with your feet, but I just wanna have it up here so I can, you know, look at it and so you can see within the frame what it looks like. Uh, so this is, I haven't messed, I literally just plugged it in and I have it running to my recorder, you know, so you can hear what I'm hearing, and uh, this is uh, factory presets. On number one, we have premium drive, which sounds like... Uh, <laughs> and the expression pedal, is assigned as a as a as a volume. What happens? Uh, let's see what happens if I. Seems to be this is control one. Seems to be like a boost. More drive. Control two. There's like a long tail delay. Oh, control three is a tuner. I won't need a, I won't need to clip a little thing here to tune it. That's cool. This is, uh, this is it. Oh, it even says tune. Of course, of course. Oh, look, you can, you can change between types, like a six string regular. I'll just set it to seven string regular. You can choose your own offset, pitch. You can choose to be muted or not. So I'm hitting a string. Well, you can see I'm all flat. I'm a little bit out of tune. Well, 
some of the strings on my guitar are in tune and some of the strings are not in tune. <laughs> but you can set this thing up any way you want to. I just went to 012 Deep Shimmer Er Reverb. What I'm trying, I think, so I think what it is, so these are each, the, the two digit number has five versions of it. And then you have essentially three controls and an expression, and then you switch between banks and then you, you can put it in different patches, different amounts of gain, gain knob, bass, treble, uh, BPM, patch level. You can, uh, oh my, it's like, I'll have to, it'll take me a little bit of time to like really go through it. Because you can, it's like uh, impulse response, like they have like, like uh, almost like an artificial intelligence or whatchamacallit like really acting like what a, a real amp would act like. Oh, I'm not even playing anything. like a movie score it's it's like a holy shit let me let me mess let me mess with it Oh, so it's like a whole, oh my God, this is a, this is a very nice. This is a very, very nice. <laughs> <laughs> this is exactly what I've been looking for. It not only has like every boss, like, you know, like delay, distortion, has like, Amp effects, cabinet responses. You know, what are those? Like, it's not a single pedal, but the boss has a, like, a DD500. I think they have, like, RV500 and, like, MD500. Those are, like, like really, like, with digital. So those three things are in it, are in this thing. So that's why I'm, like, I actually was, like, remember, I remember, like, looking up on the, on the, on the, on the catalog and, and oh, I wanted to get like an MD500 and it was like, I think like $500 and like, I was like thinking, okay, where should I get gigs where, you know, I would get more tips in my hat 
So I, I could buy that thing. And I was like counting months how long it would take me to save up. <laughs> and now boss, you know, sends me this thing. Anyways, um, I, I, can, I can just, you know, I'll just keep, I probably could like go and through each preset and like react to it and, and play something on it. And it's probably going to be like a, like a two hour video, but, uh, we're gonna, we're gonna leave that two hour video for another day. Um, thank you, boss Roland, uh, look out for an in-depth review. Look out for gigs of me playing this thing. You're gonna hear some, some very different my guitar sound like you've never heard before. And uh, definitely, definitely. Um, thanks everybody. This wouldn't be happening without subscribers, without you watching my videos, uh, commenting, sharing, enjoying the music. Uh, I'm telling you, six months ago, no one, no one could care, no one cared less about my music, and now it's like, I found. Well, I mean, there were like maybe like you know a handful of people, including my fiance and you know some small group of friends. You know, it's like, hey, <laughs> you go, and now it's like I'm finding this you know new audience <laughs> on the uh, on the interwebs. You know, I'm t that's what happens. That's what you get in a legitimate unboxing. Real unboxing, real emotions. <laughs> it should be like Oscars, okay? When you when you when you start rambling on with a speech, it's like they should like play you off. And I'd like to thank my friend who inspired me, and I would like to thank this other guy who I made a pick up the guitar, and then this. I'd like to thank my manager and the producer, and I'd like to all the people that listen to my music and and <laughs>